Awaz.ai is a no-code AI voice agent that helps businesses automate both inbound and outbound phone calls without hiring extra staff. It can handle things like reception calls, appointment setting, bookings, and client support, all with natural, human-like conversations. It works 24-7, integrates smoothly with tools like CRMs, Calendars, Zapier, Twilio, and Telnex, and can even send SMS, emails, and WhatsApp messages during calls. In this video, I'll show you how to set everything up step-by-step step and build a working AI voice agent from scratch. Let's dive in. Open your browser and visit awaz.ai. I will drop the link in the description of this video. You will be greeted with the message, Automate Phone Calls with Human-Like AI Reps. Click on Get Started to begin. This will take you to the sign-up page, but you can log in if you already have an account. Otherwise, enter your full name, followed by your email, select your country, and enter your phone number. Then create a strong password. Click Continue when you're done. Now enter the name of your brand or company. Next, choose between a personal or business account. I will go with personal for this demo. Then select the number of collaborators. You can choose any range that fits your needs, but I'll select one for now and click Continue. This is how the dashboard looks. Here you can see useful information such as the total number of calls, average call duration, total cost, and other key metrics. If you scroll down, you will also see clear visual charts that make it easy to understand your call performance at a glance. To add a phone number that clients will call, head over to Settings on the side panel. Scroll down and select Integrations. Here you'll see the different call and phone integration options available. 1. Twilio enables phone calls and SMS messaging by connecting your Twilio account to the platform. Two, Telnex is an alternative telecom provider for calls and SMS, offering similar features with flexible pricing and regional advantages. 3. API Key allows developers or external tools to securely connect to the platform for custom integrations and advanced use cases. And 4. Zapier enables no-code automation by connecting OWAS to thousands of apps, allowing you to trigger workflows, send messages, or update data automatically. To purchase a new phone number or use an existing one, click on Buy Phone. Under New Phone Number, enter your preferred area code or click on the Country option to select the country you want the number from. Next, click on the Phone Number drop-down and choose any available number. When you're done, click Order Phone Number. If you prefer to use an existing phone number, click on the New Phone Number section and select Connect Phone. Enter the phone number you want to use. For this demonstration, I'll use my personal number for testing. Click Order Phone Number when finished. Once the phone connected success message appears, you will receive an instant phone call to verify the number. Simply enter the verification code provided by Awaz during the call to complete the process. If you later decide you no longer need the number, you can return here and click Remove to delete it. Now let's add clients to the platform. Click List on the side panel. Next, click Add New List and give it a name. For this demo, I'll use Canada Clients. You can see that the new list category has now been added. Click on the pencil icon to add contacts to the list. Click Add Contact and you'll see two options. The first option allows you to add contacts manually, one by one. Enter the name, for example, Mr. Joe, then the phone number. The email and nickname fields are optional. Click Save when done you'll now see the newly added contact displayed. If you have a large number of contacts, click Add Contact again and select Import CSV. Upload a CSV file containing your contact list. Now map the fields by selecting a sample name, phone number, and email address. This helps the agent correctly identify each data field. 
click Import Data to complete the process. You'll see that the imported contacts have been added. You can edit or delete any contact you don't need. Now let's move on to creating the agent, which is the main focus of this video. Click Agent on the side panel. You'll see an empty space here because no agent has been created yet. Click New Agent, then choose whether to create from scratch or use a template. For this demo, I'll use a template. Browse through the available templates and choose one that closely matches your needs. You'll find templates for areas like higher education, nightlife, event planning, recruitment, and more. More templates will be added over time. Select one that fits your brand, give your agent a name, I'll name mine Amanda, and click Save. Now you're on the customization interface. This is where you define how your agent behaves. Start by selecting a voice. You can preview multiple voices and choose the one that best fits your brand, then click Apply This Voice. Next, set the role of the agent. I'll leave mine as event planning. You can also choose an ambient background sound, such as a coffee shop or convention hall. I prefer complete silence, so I won't select any. Make sure you enter your full company information here so the agent clearly understands what your business does and how to represent it during calls. In the Agent Objective section, enter the specific tasks and goals you want the agent to handle during conversations. On the right side of the screen, adjust the voice tone, speed, volume, responsiveness, and interaction sensitivity until it matches your preferred communication style. Now, set the maximum call duration. This defines how long the agent can stay on a call before it automatically wraps things up. Next is the ring duration, which controls how long the phone rings before the call is considered unanswered. You can enable back-channeling to allow the agent to respond naturally with short acknowledgments while the client is speaking. Finally, set how long the system should wait before ending the call if there is no activity. In the prompt section, choose who speaks first. I prefer the agent to speak first and start each call dynamically. In the prompt box, you can further describe how you want your AI agent to behave during conversations. In the action section, select what the agent should do before, during, or after calls, such as ending a call, transferring it, sending an SMS, or scheduling an appointment. Once everything is set, click Save Updates. Click Phone Call or Web Call to test your AI agent and see how it performs. This is an example of how it works. Hello. Hi, Abraham. This is Amanda from Mahiki. How are you today? I'm fine. And you? I'm great. Thanks for asking. Abraham, are you planning to be in London this year by any chance? Yes. That's exciting. Do you enjoy exclusive events or unique nightlife experiences when you're in London? Exclusive ones. Perfect. Have you heard of Mahiki's legendary outpost events like at Polo in the Park or Henley Regatta? No. They're iconic. Tiki themed parties at top UK events. Would you like early access to our new Mahiki rum launch and invites to these exclusive parties? Yes, please. Fantastic. I'll send you a link to sign up for early access and event invites. Would you like a quick overview of our upcoming events too? No, thank you. I've just sent you an SMS with the sign-up link for early access and event invites. Thank you, Abraham. Have a wonderful day and enjoy the Mahiki experience. To create campaigns, go back to the side panel and click Campaigns. This is where you manage outbound or inbound calling campaigns. Click New Campaign, enter a campaign title, and choose whether it's inbound or outbound. Select the phone number, agent, and contact list you want to use. Set the number of daily attempts, the delay between attempts, and your daily budget. Choose your time zone, then set the start and end times. You can also select specific days for the campaign to run. Click Save Campaign when finished. Use this toggle to turn the campaign on or off. Here, you can track dials, answered calls, voicemails, and more. You can turn the campaign off once it's completed. 
you can always return to the dashboard to view updated statistics and performance insights. Click Recording on the side panel to view recorded calls. Click the Play button to listen, see the cost per call, and check the call status. Click the three dots to download recordings. Click Transcription to view the text version of the call conversation. Select Analysis to see a brief AI-generated summary of the call. Click Calendar to view scheduled events, available days and times the agent can use to book or manage appointments. To update your brand information, go to Settings, then Brand Settings, where you can edit your brand name and other details. Click Save when finished. Click Teams to invite new team members. Enter their email address, select a role, and click Invite. Awaz.ai makes it incredibly easy to build a fully functional AI voice agent that can handle calls, bookings, and client interactions automatically all without writing a single line of code. If you want to try this out for yourself, check the link in the description. And if this video helped you, don't forget to like, subscribe, and leave a comment to let me know how you'd use an AI voice agent in your own business.